Hello, this is Cosmic Cat and we continue our Renpy lessons and today we will work on the main menu of our novel The City of Horizon because The City of Horizon sounds like some uh, novel about Cthulhu or something like that and this doesn't look like The City of Horizon so let's change something to uh, make it look much better. First, I don't like this blue color and this light panels because it should be more horror like so we can go to the main menu of Renpy and click change update GUI here I will choose new colors and then regenerate image files so we will uh, completely change uh, our standard UI let's continue and let's choose different color scheme of course we can uh, manually change all the colors but I want to select the base color scheme for now so I like this dark and uh, greeny uh, colors so let's continue and when it's done I go to our visual novel and press shift R to reload it and now this is much better this is more like horror vibes and let's add some background image to our main menu we go to GUI folder and let's look at these images and as you can see there is main menu image it's just a gray rectangle that is uh, 1920 by 1080 pixels and this gray rectangle is our background image and we can just replace it with a new background I prepared this image by SV games it has the game's name and it's 1920 by 1080 pixels just name it main dash menu PNG copy to GUI folder and replace the previous image and when we go to our visual novel here it is the city of Ryzen but we don't need the game's name here so we go to options RPY and look at the line define GUI show name equals true and change it to equals false so we don't want to show the name of the game here and now this looks much better and I think that this side panel is a bit too dark so I will make it a bit more transparent and this side panel is hidden in overlay folder let's go here and we see main menu PNG let's open it in GIMP we see our transparent side panel and to make it more transparent we change the opacity of the whole layer like this let's say 70% maybe 65 and then click file override main menu PNG and when we go to our game we see that this panel looks more transparent okay that's what I need then let's start the game I haven't changed the game yet and when I go to the menu we see this boring gray background and I want to change it too and this boring gray background is this file game menu PNG just replace it with my image it's an image of Cthulhu underwater and well we uh, can see him very well that's because there is another overlay over this uh, background image and we want to make it more transparent too let's go to overlay folder again and we see game menu PNG open it in GIMP and mm, let's make it more transparent again file Overwrite game menu and now we see our beautiful Cthulhu in the game 
that is much much better great what else can we add in the main menu well we can add music because now our game is completely silent so let's add music in the main menu let's go to options rpi again and let's search the line that says define config main menu music and we see that it's commented so we uncomment this line and now it says defined config main menu music is main menu theme dot ogg so our music file should be named like this but i have a music file that is in wav wav format so i need to make it ogg and we can do this with audacity it's completely free software that you can use to change formats of your audio files let's put our scary horror ambience in audacity file export audio export to computer and format we choose og vorbis file just press export and we have our scary horror ambience number five ogg but we should rename it main menu theme ogg and then copy this file to our games folder right here and now let's open our game and now we can hear our beautiful scary ambience in the main menu now this game really looks like the city of horizon yeah that's much better but there is one last thing i must and should do i should go to options rpy again and here <laughs> where i have written music by Mandalina Bella Balalaika. I must specify the real author of this music. This uh, horror ambience was made by Andy SV. So I write music by Andy SV. And I think you should credit everyone that uh, worked on your novel. So Andy SV made this track. I bought it on Humble Bundle and I think that uh, it would be fair to say that this music was by Andy Essie. So now we are ready to start working on the city of Ryzen. So thank you and that's all for today. Till the next time.